sick. Um, continue? Sure. Right, so the two parallel stories going on. What a night. We got two parallel stories. One is Adam. Um, he has a son and a wife and a, a seemingly stable relationship. Then there is the other guy whose name I can't quite recall, but I'll we'll soon be, you know, we'll soon figure it out. He is in a dysfunctional relationship. It looks like the wife has taken the kid. And he's been given like a robot and he's like really anti like tech anti robot. Because of, you know, big brother, I guess. Um, I have heard very good things about this game. Um, and we only just started the uh, the playthrough. We might finish it this stream. Um, and if so, that'd be pretty cool. And then, um, yeah, I'll add some more things to the um, to the store. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? All right. I'm just checking audio levels. Yeah, you can barely hear it, I think. So it looks like you've woken up in the middle of the night. Uh, that melody. Amy? Amy. Yeah. As soon as we do that, it's probably going to change it to a different cutscene. You see how I pitch it, boy? God, it's, it's a little bit janky. Oh yeah. Proud of my son. First of May. Um by the way, um on the Epic Game Store, they're currently giving away Paradigm, a very interesting point and click adventure for free. So I'm not um enthused about the Epic Game Store, but I do have an account. For the sole purpose of claiming free games so if you're in the market for a free game and you don't mind point and click it looked pretty cool from what i saw there was also an um another game but you know there is one question in this world john that you should be asking yourself every day are you truly happy the fuck? happiness comes from your brain I could tell you a lot about your happy brain, about dendrites and synapses, but that would be quite boring. So instead, imagine a case. This is a fucking brainwashing. A small, hollow ball filled with a sweet liquid, like a cherry. That's how it all began, with the brain of a little primeval tapeworm. Let's call him Bob. Of course, Bob was not his real name. Tapeworms had long tapeworm names, just as long as their bellies, of which they were famously proud. But sadly, nobody remembers those true tapeworm names. Now, Bob lived in his little hole in the ground and was totally happy with his life. The earth was warm and comfortable, just like your bed. And with that, he was quite satisfied. But one day, Bob realized that the world around him was changing. It was growing cold and damp and wasn't comfortable at all anymore. This made Bob very sad. Because when the world changed, Bob would have to change too. It's very fucked. And neither his happiness nor his lovely long belly could stay the same. So the tapeworm did something very interesting. He took his head and carefully turned it inward on himself to the ball with the sweet liquid that was his brain. Now, Bob's outside world was completely connected with his inside world. And when the outside world would change, his inside world was safe. That way, in the ball with the sweet liquid, the little worm sweet could preserve liquid. his happiness forever. Sweet and he liquid. lived happily ever after until the end of prehistory. So remember, when the world and everything around us becomes cold and damp, we have to turn our outsides in. 
and let our outside and our inside become one. And when you close your eyes, little John, then imagine how that would feel. Be cool to my kid. <laughs> that was truly disturbing. Or oh, John. Ah, yeah, for my son. My son's name is John. Very strange. Right. What is that? Data fragment. What the hell is going on here? It's pretty dangerous. Please contact a member of season five. Found him. Don't check that. Contemplating man. Yeah, I think Rodin did it better the first time. This is kind of spooky. Alright. I'm losing my mind. I'm actually losing my mind. Actually. Or is this some kind of stupid test? It's a test, isn't it? Maybe it's a test. Maybe it's not. Who knows? Alright. He's just been beaten up, that's right. He was trying to get, um, something. He was beaten up. Did they take all my money? Steve? Wow, Richard. You don't look good. No. It's fine. Just ran into a bit of trouble. Ooh. The dealer downstairs, you mean? Hm. What are you doing? Come up here. Alright. Looks I think it was it what Jade or Jace. Yeah, Jace sicked his goons on me and beat me up. All I was trying to do was get some uh, password cracking stuff from him. Hmm. But instead he whooped my ass. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. what's this? Oh, I don't think I can use that. I mean, I might be able to, to go to different areas, but... It's not necessary. I don't know what... Near enough. Let's avoid the uh, T-1000s. Let's go back into the building. He reckons he's got something. You're the voice trying to understand it. Oop. Give me in. Man, Richard. Look at you. You're, you're a walking corpse. Yep, Did you at least Steve. get what you wanted? Yep, here. Don't look at me like that. It's just a password. Will you help me? Fine. But I can tell you right now that it's not going to be quick. Oh, we do that all okay. online. I have to get a copy of the database first. How long will that take? A day at least. Well, okay. I have some other stuff to do anyway. You know, concerning those dealers. Yeah, yeah some payback. You report them? You know, I'd be careful if I were you. You know what one of those guys told me? That I'm dead. What? I, that, that's a joke, surely. Or, or a threat. Didn't sound like it. Some guy called Jay is telling everybody, apparently. Richard, they're junkies. They're high. They hang out all day in Neverland or wherever it is they go these days. Yeah. Jay, or maybe J-A-Y. Do you know who they meant by that? Maybe a hacker. Something was with his arm. Huh. A hacker. Jay, something with his arm. Augmented, maybe. Th th that rings a bell. Wasn't there a, a narco? Well, it looks like I cut off that cutscene. Awesome. Now, hold on. I'll send you some material from the archives. Yeah. Maybe you'll find him there. Okay. All right. 
find out who Jay is and where he might hide. Jack McHale, augmented arms, hacker. Hmm. J. J. Kazowski, wanted terrorist in hiding. In hiding? Okay, but where? Mm hmm. Breakpoint, huh? Hmm. Augmentation scientist. J. Kazowski. I wonder if this is like predicting the future kind of thing, yeah? Imagine that. Companies requiring augmentation as a prerequisite. Don't laugh. Don't laugh, it could fucking happen. Wonderful. Mm. Jack McHale. Okay, so much for Jack. Hmm, or was he? connected to the doomsday club the breakpoint hackers probably breakpoint so j kosolski j kosolski jeff kosowski augmented arm hmm He will be a better human, apparently. Apparently. Yeah, I think that's everything. Here, yeah, this looks interesting. Jeff Kazowski, researcher in the field of robotics, augmentation of the right lower arm, Luddite, break. Point went under the radar. Connections to Berlin's anarchy scene. Doomsday. That's an anarchist's club. I could try there. Mm. Okay, Steve. Thanks. I'll call you about the move scan search. Y you want to go to Doomsday? Are you mad? Fuck There's you. a raid there every other week. I want to know why I am apparently dead. Oh, come on, Richard. That's just junky talk. You're alive. Concentrate on Tracy and James. And on your health. I don't know, Steve. I don't have a good feeling about it. Why does he think I'm dead? Maybe he knows something about James, too. Maybe. Alright. Cool. Can I get another copy? The press conference yesterday to make the announcement. According to Mark, they will call you in the Oh, look at all that sushi, it just makes me hungry. No, looks like I can't. Can I go make poo poo? No. Oh, this one is interesting. 
Then you have the, uh... How is he gone? That's the old disc. Are you still just hanging about? Yeah, he's just hanging about. What a peanut. Alright. Do that fired me is no longer there. Alright, I see how it is. Alright, let's get out of here. How's that how's that shiner looking? That's pretty good. Okay. So we have two options. Look for our kid or go the doomsday place. And I think the the game is gently pushing me in the direction of go check out the doomsday club. Unless it wants me to go back to my abode, my humble, humble abode, we can do that too. Already back, sir. What does it look like? Have you had a successful day so far? No. I need honey, All don't I? Ingredients are missing to assemble this product: honey, wheat, palm oil. No yum yum for me. Oh, my Roomba. Um, uh, maybe I need to... Yeah, that thing is, is following me everywhere. Like, he's keeping track. Keeping tabs. That's very sus. Alright. Where's my son? Where's James? Man in the apartment with six triangles. Move scan, yeah, yeah. Um, let's, uh, let's go. Let's go. Boys? Still no word of them, sir. No. I apologize. Perhaps we should try... We should try nothing. Exactly, robot. How dare you. It's a wonderful family, sir. If you like. think. You should take good care of them. Bruh. So, Doomsday. Gonna have to get into that cab, I reckon. Wait, is it this way? Can't get in the cab. Can I get on there? Well, now I already gave him your coffee. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I gave him something, um, a Mars bar or something. Oh, can I get around to the other? No. I can just look at them from afar. Could try going upstairs or checking out this guy. No one, what happened to you? It's nothing, I'm okay. I got punched Man, in my head. I'm calling Medi Central. What I'm you okay. fucking dare? I'm okay. <laughs> Stop it. I'm okay. Story administration building was ah. destroyed by five missiles. News from New York. All right. That's a sick looking train. Or monorail.
Shit. Everything's looking pretty jacked around here. That looks like a cop vehicle. Can I interact with you? No. Neverland. No streaming. An authorized streamers will be permanently banned. That's pretty sick. I'd imagine that if you're a streamer streaming Neverland, you'd be a very popular content creator. Okay. Okay. He looks very happy. Alright, let's go see the cops. Let's see what they want. Oh, no, no. We can't. So it was behind... Okay, so I'm guessing that's like a police station, perhaps? Wait, what's this? What's this? What's that say? Interesting. Animorphs. Ah, there's Doomsday. Okay. But prior to... Police bot, what? What's going on here, sir? Berlin Police. Please stay behind the line. This is a measure for your security. Okay, okay. Thank you for your cooperation. You care. Hmm. Well. Come on, man. Let us in. Okay. We'll have our in over Richard here. Richard Nolan? Ah, just what I needed. Brought to you by Jeff. I almost didn't recognize you. You've some nerve to come back here. Isn't this where the scum of techno capitalism gathers to die? In your article back then? Sorry, Faye, but I'm in a bit of a hurry. Yeah, we'll be using her to get in, I reckon. It's Where's quite Tracy? obvious. How dare you talk about my wife? How dare. Oh, wait, wait, Faye, Faye, wasn't the one that, um, he was talking to? Rrr. Interesting. Maybe it was Faye. No, Lydia. Who's Lena? Currently, all signals within Sucker 36 are disabled. Damn, no reception. Shit. Find a way to bypass the signal. Hmm. No, that's not it. You? You have reception? You're joking. Can't you see what's going on here? Does Faye have reception? The Shmi? Okay, one second. Somebody's coming. Hey, man, do you play Neverland? You need a starter kit? I can get you everything. Your houses, your ships, wings. You sell real life things, too? <laughs> real life? Yeah, sure, if you're in it. You, you name it, I got it. Uh, what do you need, man? Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, some noob. I'll disconnect. Mm -hmm. Yeah, some noob. You have reception? Yeah, of course. How'd you get it? Wizard. I could get it for you, but it's not entirely legal. I get that. How much? 900? 900? I can live for a month off that much. Hey, there are drones everywhere, man. You want a deal like that? Go to Neverland. Hmm. Fine. And here you go. Your 
wizard. Hi, Mina. Wow. Why do I Mina. have honor? Is Tracy there too? No. Something happened? Yeah. No, no, everything's fine. Huh. I think this is the first time we've ever had a chat. Hey, listen, Mina, I need to meet a couple of people at the club and... You don't have a companion code. I'll send you one. Meet me inside by the entrance. Sick. No data from unknown. Sick. Was in here? Okay. I think we're good. My companion code. Where'd you get that from? All right, in you go. But don't tell me I didn't warn you. Hmm. -hmm. Meet me by the entrance. There she is. Hmm. She's gonna pull me up, probably. Or not? What are you waiting for? I'm inside, just near the entrance. No data from unknown. Well, new data. Hmm. Message. Not now. Not now. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Calm down. Calm down, buddy. Maybe. Okay. We gotta go through here. Okay. I thought that that was Mina. Okay. That's pretty sick. Look at that. Dang. Cyber. Oh. oh. Can I please let me into your establishment? Hello. Hello. Richard Nolan. In Doomsday. In Doomsday. Tracy's gonna kill you. <laughs> you don't have to tell her. Well, she never calls anyway. Mina. No, it's fine. I get it. Family. Kids. It hasn't been easy for her recently. Oh, come on. She still calls Jennifer. Is she still working for Bote? Bote. <laughs> you really haven't seen each other in a while. I'm looking for a certain Jeff. Kazowski, I think he's called. Kazowski? Oh, God. What do you want from him? I just need to get to know him. Uh-huh. Well, if you need to, ask Louisa. Behind the bar. She's into guys like him. Richard, wait a second. What? Does Tracy still do... You know. No, I don't, you know. <sighs> don't look at me like that. I need to escape sometimes, you know. 
I you really know? can't help you out there, Mina. Then at least give me a couple of credits. I'm completely broke. How is that possible? Uh, fuck it. Thanks. You're the best. Hey, you come here often now, huh? Taking a break from family life? Must feel good. Can I... What? Ah. I didn't get um the other two options because I, I chose the main one first. I went straight for the kill. Yeah. Right, Louisa behind the bar. Let's check out the toilets. Gentlemen. Yep. What's up, bro? Cool. Let me go in here. Can't go in there? Cool. I'll just, uh, well, I'll uh, leave you gentlemen here. Alright, thanks. Hey girls, uh, yep, bye bye. I had to go in there. No, the wall is back. Some might say that the wall was always there. Oh shit, is that Mina? And having fun? Oh yeah. You come down. here often, right? Yeah. Why not? I got everything I need here. Methylene and shots. You are always a charmer, Richard. Ew. How are you? Stressed. Got three shows next week. I'm going crazy. Really? For a big designer? Yep. Front and center. Not bad. Tracy's probably jealous, right? Wouldn't know. Trying to get into contact with Tracy. Oh wait, 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 wait! Is that the downstairs? Look at I'm having fun. We'll be down there soon. We'll be down there soon. Big boy's like, hell no! You're not getting past this door. Get lost. All right. Hey, right, bruh. Oh, doggo. For fuck's sake. Oh, filtered. That is actually kind of cool. Fuck's sake. Alright. Let's now go around here. Yep, just stand uh, staring off into the distance. Yep, love it. Staying with his homies. Yeah, yeah, cool, cool, cool. Oh, you're dancing. Oh, you're dancing. Iggy Starstruck. Can I actually interact with that? Please get past. Yeah, yeah. Can't get past her. 